Tonight's Wiz Quiz contests are brought to you by The Union Bank Company, committed to you. And by the Tom All Family of Dealerships, Chrysler, Buick, Dodge, and Hyundai, the home of the Knock Your Socks Off deal. Welcome back, everyone. We're right in the middle of a game between New Bremen High School and Delphus St. John's. Our score right now, Delphus, you have 20 points. <laughs> New Bremen with 50. That means, New Bremen, you're going to lead off this second round. We have five questions worth five points apiece. They are all yours. Please buzz in, though, with your answer, okay? Number one, name the home of Thomas Jefferson. Yes. Um, Philadelphia. Philadelphia is incorrect. The answer is Monticello. Who conquered England in 1066? Yes. Julius Caesar. That is incorrect. William the Conqueror is the answer. All right. Number three. Identify the Japanese word for goodbye. Yes. Sayonara. That is correct. Sayonara. To what geographic area does NAFTA apply? Yes. North America. Very good. North America. We've heard enough about NAFTA, right? <laughs> All right. Question five. Give the formal name for a lie detector. Yes. A polygraph. Polygraph is the answer. All right, very good. Turning now to Delphus, your five questions. Everybody ready here? Mm -hmm. All right. What Microsoft co-founder was bestowed honorary knighthood? Bill Gates. All right, time is up. The answer is Bill Gates. All right. Did you mention that here and you just didn't I just asked day? him. And oh, I was shoot. All right. <laughs> Question two. Name the garden where Jesus prayed before his crucifixion. Gethsemane. Yeah. That is right. Gethsemane. Who is famous for illustrating many Saturday evening post covers? Norman Rockwell is the answer. What French leader escaped from the island of Elba in 1815? Yes. Napoleon. Napoleon is the answer. And here's your final question in round two. What word means the process by which a foreigner becomes a citizen? All right, we had the buzzer over here first, so we're not going to be able to take your answer. It is naturalization. All right, we've come to the end of round two. Moving into round three now, Delphus, you have 30 points. New Bremen was 65. These again, 10 questions were 10 points apiece, all up for grabs. Get those buzzers ready. And name the English physician that discovered circulation of the blood. New Bremen. William Harvard. That is incorrect. Delphus, do you want to try? The answer is William Harvey. Number two. What is the other name for Armistice Day, the end of World War I? Yes, New Bremen. Veterans Day. You are correct, Veterans Day. Give the compound word designating tremors following a major earthquake. Uh, aftershock? I'm sorry? Aftershock? Aftershock is the answer. All right, what is the C word meaning a flesh-eating predatory animal? New Bremen. Carnivore? Carnivore is the answer. Name the grinning animal in Alice's Adventures in, yes, Delphus. The Cheshire Cat. Cheshire Cat is correct. In what year was the Eiffel Tower part of the Paris International Exposition? New Bremen. 1890. That is incorrect. Delphus, you want to try? 
1980. That is also incorrect. You were one year off, 1889. All right, question number seven. Identify the acronym IHOP. Yes, Delphus. I know. International House of Pancakes. That is correct. What U.S. Navy ship, spy ship, was captured by North Korea in 1968? New Bremen. USS Eisenhower. That is incorrect. So, Delphus, you've got a chance to answer this. USS Arizona. That is also incorrect. Pueblo is the answer. All right, two questions remaining in your game. Give the three official colors of Mardi Gras. Yes. Gold, purple, and green. Gold, purple, and green is correct. Very good. All right, here's your last question in your game. Harper Lee wrote what famous novel set in the 19 New Bremen? To Kill a Mockingbird. To Kill a Mockingbird is the answer. All right, we've come to the end of our game between Delphus St. John's and New Bremen. And we have a winner, Delphus. You have 70 points. New Bremen will be moving on with 95 points. Congratulations. Thank you very much, Delphus, for playing. And we will see you back here right after the break for a game between Bodkins and Finley. Don't go away.